Here's a couple of fellas that need a ride. Good evening, gentlemen. Hello. Where are we headed? Caesar's Palace. Caesar's Palace? We're going to get some dinner there. Well... You guys are in the cash cab. We are in the cash cab. It's a TV we? game show that takes place right here in my taxi. How exciting is that? How are you, fellas? Nice to meet you. Never been better, boss. Nice to meet you, <laughs> Welcome sir. Welcome aboard. Keep it down while you're in here, would you? <laughs> and you're playing for a charity tonight? Right, we are. We're going to be playing for AFAN. AFAN, Which is an okay. organization that gives uh, care to people who are suffering with AIDS. Oh, okay. If my knowledge of this show is correct, they'll be getting Jack. So I don't think we'll be very good at that. <laughs> you think I'm going to kick you out? All right, let's take a ride in the Cash Cab, Las Vegas. Okay. So tell everyone your names. My name is Penn Gillette. This is my partner, Teller. We are Penn and Teller. All right, we're headed to Caesar's Palace. That's about three miles away, so you'll have three miles to rack up as much money as possible. So let's get started right away. Are you ready? I'm ready. Ooh, this just in from Cash Cab Headquarters. This is a double down ride. Oh, yeah. That means all the dollar amounts are doubled. You'll have a chance to win twice as much money. Oh, it also good. means these first questions are worth $100 a piece instead of 50. So let's get started. Here's your first one. Although it was little and white, not little and red, what classic Chevy sports car first rolled off the assembly line in 1953? <laughs> it was little and white and not little and red. Not little and red. Well, I guess that's a reference to uh, Little Red Corvette by Prince. So I'll say Corvette. Corvette is correct. Take it over the $100. That was hard. That was about the easy one. All right, you're one for one. You have 100 bucks. Let's see if you can double it. According to a 2010 movie review, what heavy metal Marvel Comics hero combines Bill Gates, Howard Hughes, and Hugh Hefner. Iron Man. Iron Man is correct. Do you want to use them? It's Iron Man, yeah. Okay. Iron Man. All right, 200 going on 300. Here's your next question for 100. Sparking a tourist industry in Bradford, Pennsylvania, what company operates a museum devoted to its metal lighters? Yeah, that's Zippo, right? Zippo. Zippo is correct. And you're three for three, guys. 300 bucks. Let's see if you can make it four. Also a fast food sandwich featuring fried chicken as bread. What blackjack option is often recommended if you have a hard 11? A hard 11? Um, a double down. Double down is right, and you're up to 400 bucks. All right, four for four on the hundreds. These next questions are worth 200 bucks 200. a piece. We've got about two and a half miles to go. Consisting of chocolate-covered caramels, what Hershey's candy alludes to the fact that none of its pieces are perfectly round? Uh, uh, not, not turtles. Pieces? Oh no, strike one! Milk duds, milk duds. Milk duds. Chocolate covered oh, caramel, milk I love duds. Those too. Strike one. Two more of those and I have to kick you out. According to its Ministry of Foreign Affairs, what Scandinavian country is home to 5.3 million people and 2 million saunas? Swedish sauna? Is that, is that what they say for sauna? No. Swedish! No, no, strike two! It's Finland! Oh, Finland, no. and that's your second strike. I have a good friend in Finland, too. About a half a mile from Caesars, here is your next question. One of the oldest bars in the U.S., Jean Lafitte's blacksmith shop, is a former pirate hangout in what city? Shout out. All right, a shout out. A mobile or a street shout out? I would like to use a mobile shout out. All right, and who will you be calling? Well, we, we Robbie Libin or Perry? Which do you think would know this? Robbie? Okay. All right, you're calling Robbie. Hello, Robbie Libin. We are in the cash cab, and we have a question we don't know the answer to. One of the oldest bars in the U.S. One of the oldest bars in the U.S. Jean Lafitte's blacksmith shop. Jean Lafitte's blacksmith shop. Is a former pirate hangout. Is a former pirate hangout. In what city? In what city? Tell her thinks New, or New Orleans, so does Robbie. New Orleans. New Orleans is correct. Thank you, to Thank you. All right, we're pulling into Caesar's Palace. You guys have 600 bucks and two strikes. It looks like it's all going to come down to this final question. All right, we're pulling into Caesar's Palace. You guys have 600 bucks and two strikes. It looks like it's all going to come down to this final question. 800 or nothing. Here it is. Don't forget about your street shout out. Known for its nylon shorts, what soccer gear company got its name by mashing up its original moniker, Humphrey Brothers? Humphrey Brothers. Humphrey Brothers. We better use a shout out. Shout out, all right. Your street shout out it is right here okay. at the entrance to Caesar's Palace. All right, guys, we're all set. So choose wisely and good luck.
That guy right there. That guy? Call him over. Tell him what's... We're in the cash cab. Come over here. Come over here. We're in the cash cab. Now, listen, sir. Uh, we're playing this game for AFAN, which is an AIDS organization. There's a lot of pressure on you, okay? All right, here we go. Known for its nylon shorts. Known for its nylon shorts. What soccer gear company? What soccer gear company got its name? By mashing up its original moniker. By mashing up its original moniker. Humphrey Brothers. Humphrey Brothers. Soccer shorts company. Nylon soccer. Nylon soccer shorts company. Umbro. Umbro. Umbro is right. Thank you. I will not kiss you. I love you. And we're here so you guys just won 800 bucks in the cash cab. Awesome game, fellas. You made it to Caesar's Palace. You racked up 800 bucks in the cash cab. I've got it right here. I can give it to you now. You can take it and be on your way. Or you can stick around and risk it all and go double or nothing on a video bonus question. What you don't understand is this is for charity. Yes. So it's not money for us. Let's risk it all. <laughs> all right. Let's go for the video bonus. Yeah, video bonus. <laughs> all right, guys, here it is, the big moment. Take a look at the screen and good luck. Working overtime in these Sin City street signs, the element neon belongs to an elite class of non-reactive gases that also includes helium and argon. What is the name of this upper crust category of elements? It's in inert, right? Did he say inert in the question? No, he didn't. Those are inert gases. No, oh, no! Inert is incorrect. What They're is it? Noble gases. Noble, noble gases. gases. We've got $800 here. Would you do us a favor and give that to uh, AFAN? Because even though you don't care about our charity, we do. We care about your charity. You guys are going to donate the $800? Yeah, sure, bucks? of course. Oh, well, that's nice. Of course we'll do that. All right. Well, you guys are going to put in the eight, even though you didn't win. Sure, of course. And we're going to throw five on top of that. Good thinking. All right. So Absolutely. Even though you guys Thank lost you so the charity much. wins. We lost everything. Thanks for playing, guys. We lost it was, everything. You did. You lost we everything. Lost everything. It was humiliating for everyone involved. We lost everything. Thanks for playing, guys. That was fun. Nice to meet you.